Gregory Peck worked for free to help 600,000 people. Peck lost his son Jonathan in 1975. Jonathan Peck took his own life. Gregory took it very hard. He stopped making movies. He disappeared from the public eye. But in 1980, automaker Chrysler ran into trouble. Their sales were critically low. Chrysler said it would have to lay off 600,000 workers. Peck met Chrysler chairman Lee Iacocca in Detroit. He brought Frank Sinatra with him. The stars signed on as Chrysler boosters. Peck starred in TV commercials for the new 1981 Chrysler K, but he refused any payment for this work. He did it to save the factory jobs. That's the difference between good times or hard times for 600,000 families. I told Mr. Iacocca I wanted to help. It worked and the layoff was averted.